Hi friends, in this video we are going to create a business website using free Elementor WordPress theme. So if you want a serious business website and with minimal effort and with using free resources, this video is for you. In this video we are going to create this website and it is a perfect website for a serious type or minimal requirement website and it is a perfect website of course and it loads very fast and it has all the basic pieces available with this in a single click demo import so you can have this theme and this is a uh, free WordPress theme. I am going to tell you where you can get this theme and how you can download this theme for free. And in this video, I am going to create a website and you can also follow the same procedure to get, create a professional website for your business and it is going to be absolutely free. And if you want a free hosting plan for hosting your website, just you need to follow the link and book a domain and uh, I'll tell you how you can get a free hosting plan and free Elementor WordPress theme for your business website and you can create your website at your own even I'm going to help you in the create, creating the text content so everything will be free here just you need to book a domain for you and that can be done by following the link given in the description okay so if you are new to this channel please subscribe this channel because i am going to bring wonderful wordpress resources for you uh, free and even premium resources uh, we are going to overview all the things for wordpress websites and in this website we are going to create a business website like this so okay so i am starting the website installation first of all so I am assuming you have already installed the WordPress core and I have this press installation of WordPress and this is running the default 2022 WordPress theme on the latest version of WordPress and I have already downloaded the theme pack in this video only I am also going to tell you where you can also download the uh, theme that we are going to use to create this website absolutely free and i have this theme pack and the theme pack i have this uh, uh, these elements like this is the theme pack that we are going to use for installation and this is some elements for manual installation purpose so database and all files are here and only so we are going to use this file in our installation purpose also and this is webolin theme and i'll definitely tell you uh, where you can download this theme and webion sorry so theme name is webion so i will tell you where you can get this theme i'll definitely add the link let us first create our website upload the theme and create our website and import the demo content and overview the options what we can do with this theme so actually uh, we need to install first of all and we will overview the complete functionality that we can how we can create pages and how we can edit the existing content and we have already seen the uh, the, the live demo okay so I'll I'm coming back to this this is our target website and this okay so let us start our installation first to install the theme we have to be on the appearance section so i am assuming you have already installed the wordpress core or at your hosting at your domain and as i told you if you want a free hosting plan just let me know by following the link in the, in the description i will definitely arrange a free hosting i will give you a link where you can get the free hosting uh, with 10 gb of disk space so it is absolutely free and for life time so and without any ads so don't worry for that 
So you can start your website immediately by using this free theme, free hosting. You just need to take your domain name because that is necessary uh, for uh, starting a website. So you need to book a domain name and you can uh, follow the link uh, for uh, registering the domain name as well. So that where you can get the uh, sufficient amount of discount as well. Okay, in registering domain name and let us begin the installation. So uh, we have to go in the uh, theme section of WordPress and here we have already downloaded the theme and here we can add the theme click on add new and upload theme choose file it is very simple installation so I'll show you so this is web violin light theme and here we have this theme pack and I'm uploading this theme if just in case if you are will Mm, absolutely new uh, to WordPress and you want your theme to be installed by us I will definitely give you a pre-installed theme with free hosting and everything to start your website you just uh, ping me uh, in the description of in the comment section of this video and or even you can follow the link given in the description so we can start our discussion and I'll definitely install this theme for you at your domain and at your hosting. So uh, now you can see the theme has been installed successfully and this is the message where theme has been installed and now I'm activating this theme. So it is so simple. It is nothing like technical thing. So now and the, we have got an alert that we need to install a certain plugin called Jet Plugin Wizard. So let us begin this installing this plugin. So it is only one plugin here. So simply install this. And as of now, okay. So plugin installed and activated successfully in a second. It is pretty simple. And now I'm just refreshing this page. So plugin installed. So okay. This wizard will help you to select a scan, install plugins, and import demo data of Babion. Babion Light theme. This is the theme name Babion Light, and I'll uh, tell you now uh, where you can get this theme. So this is the live demo, and I have obtained this theme already. Downloaded this theme from I I got this theme from Template Monsters. So you can also avail this theme from template monster and it is available free of course it, it has been developed by the rock themes and this is the link and that I am going to add in the description of this video you'll get my website link and there you can get all the links uh, of relevant links um, for getting the uh, domain name or the theme download or hosting whatever you want so that is there so you can avail this theme by just by sharing this link to your Facebook or Twitter or LinkedIn account and it is absolutely free as you can see and uh, if you want somehow if you want the premium version this is also available but it will cost you $83 as of now. But yes we in this video we are uh, using the free one and this is I have already downloaded it and this is the free one so we are going to create this website in this video. So I believe this is a sufficient website for a starting business or a serious business website like this. So it, it is very good. Okay, so now we have uh, now coming back to the uh, installation screen and um, this setup wizard is going to help us and now we can start install. So it is very simple. And first of all, it is going to show the system information just in case if it is not green, you will not be able to proceed further. So make sure uh, this these minimal requirements should be fulfilled. And now, okay, so since here all is green, I am going to proceed next. And okay, so okay, so uh, it is Fabian Light and we can start install so it is just a click click and click and it is very simple to install so the recommended plugins are here and we can uh, install recommended plugins here so th this is being a elementor theme so I, as i told in the beginning of this video so we have to install elementor first of all and jet data importer is required for importing the demo content and contact form 7 
is creating uh, for for creating the contact forms okay so uh, i must tell you one thing if any theme or any installation of wordpress is using very less number of plugins it is going to be more stable and successful so this theme uses only three plugins in addition to the uh, core theme so this is going to really a wonderful website and you will be able to create pages as you like so you can even use elementor template kits for adding more designed pages and it is also very simple and uh, i have shown in my other, other videos uh, at this channel only where you can how you can create the uh, website or web pages using elementor template kit so this that is also a very unique and creative way to create new pages at at your website okay so let us proceed towards next and the next step will install some necessary plugins jet data importer elementor page builder has been installed now and the contact from seven got installed it is very simple so all three plugins got installed and now we have option append demo content to my existing so it is going to import the demo data and it is asking what we actually want to do with our website so this is being a completely new website but you we can keep a like append demo content to my existing content so it is not going to overwrite anything so it is just appending and you can even choose to replace my existing content and skip demo as well so i am choosing to append demo content to my existing content it is a good thing so i'm going to next and okay so now the screen progress bar is showing yeah, what we got and it is very fast and pretty cool and it is so simple so uh, it is importing the post authors media and terms and okay so now it is going to regenerate thumbnails okay so it is a very good thing if uh, a website is using uh, resides thumbnails it is going to present the images on the different device according to the device size uh, and uh, requirements so let us say if any visitor is using uh, opening your website at at his mobile phone so uh, images will be served accordingly uh, in in the dimension that is required for the mobile phone similarly uh, it is applicable for tablets desktops and laptops so uh, regenerating thumbnail is a very good thing for any wordpress website so you can use this tools additionally but um, the good thing is that with this theme that it has been already included in the theme uh, installation system itself so it is re regenerating the thumbnails and it may take uh, some time but you have to uh, show your patience on this screen don't hinder the process don't disturb the process and uh, i'm sure you are going to get a wonderful website by following these steps and i have already shown where you can download the theme and you can have the premium version of this theme so this is babion uh, premium version and you can avail this theme by following the the link here um, buy now option and this is light it is absolutely free and i have like you can also download like me as i have downloaded and okay so uh, you can also avail the 15% discount if you rate uh, the template you purchase and get a discount okay so this is also a good way to get a discount okay wonderful so this is the live demo and let us see what is going here so it is on 93% it is very simple and it is not taking much time so it is hardly uh, one and a half minutes for me and it depends on your server speed as well and your internet speed if it is sufficient it will not take time now it is 100 percent and it is wonderful so congratulations you are all set and this is a wonderful message that we are waiting for and don't know from where to start let us help you so you can also take help and okay so view your site this is the option where we can preview our website 
and yes the complete website is here and we got the complete website here and everything that we seen in the demo is now on our installation at our demo uh, domain so it is really wonderful and we have received all the contents in the same look and feel as we seen in the demo website so it is really cool and simple way of creating website so our website is complete and i am now uh, on the back end so this is our website and this is time and to show you to uh, let you know how you can edit the content so i am assuming you are completely new to the wordpress and if you are expert so <laughs> you don't need to learn all these things so it is very simple and this video is for um, the, the people who are uh, using the wordpress at very first time or very new at the wordpress cms or the website development okay so um, now uh, i'm coming back to the dashboard again and we can see so pl plugin wizard is here demo content we have already used and i'll go to the plugins to show you how only three plugins are a data importer we can now deactivate and delete because we have already used this and this was for only a single time use jet up plugin wizard can also uh, be deactivated and deleted so uh, let us see uh, what is the impact on the website so um, what i advise just keep only those plugins active that you actually need for your website wp reset is not for you i am using this so um, i have deactivated two plugins jet data importer and jet plugin with sart and let us see if it is impacting our website anyhow so i believe it is not required now so your website is intact so we can simply deactivate these two plugins and mm, we can dismiss this notice because uh, it is it has been already used and we can even delete these two plugins so i am now deleting these two plugins it is not required just to show you so this theme is using just two plugins that is elementor itself as, as a page builder and contact form 7 for creating contact form that is for this page only okay so now uh, the great thing is that we have only two plugins and we have the live website and this theme is absolutely free this is a wonderful thing that we can start our website uh, using a free theme and it is a perfect website for business and now i am going to show you how you can edit the content so this theme uses elementor page builder and you can simply edit the content using the elementor page builder so just open the page that you want to edit and click on edit let us say we are going to edit the home page itself so uh, open the home page and click on edit with elementor okay so this is the editor view and uh, it is pretty simple to edit the content just click on the area that you want to edit and you will be able to edit the content this is background image and this is, can be uh, like this background image can be changed here so in the style just click on here and in the style so just keep in mind you have to use same dimension image as, as has been used in the demo uh, demo website so this is uh, this needs to be taken care of, so you cannot change the dimension of image however um, you can change the image so this is the image where you can change and for changing the text also if you are wondering how you can know the i'll show you how you can check the image so uh, just right click and okay so this is not showing the image size this browser is okay so i'll show you again okay, now i have opened the website in the firefox web browser that time i was using chromium for uh, recording purpose now i have opened the website in the firefox web browser and now i can show you uh, 
how you can know the image dimension this was the thing and just right click and open image in new tab and here is the image so you can simply save this image and know the size what is the size of image so it is very simple to understand so you have to use same dimension image and same uh, so try to use a very lightweight image you can optimize the image using on any online tool so this is very simple thing so now uh, um, we can come back to the editor screen and for editing the text content you can simply click on the area and this will be the uh, area where you can edit the content again so i am telling you you have to use the same length uh, text at, as has been used in the demo so i am going to tell you a very important thing this link is showing this the external link and that is going to developer website and you have to change all the external link just in case if you are not sure what link is to be kept you can keep uh, change like has and you have to change all the links and relevant links should be here and no external links should be here like contact us is again going to uh, land you on another website and i am simply um, keeping the has and later you can change the relevant and it is very simple to edit the content just click on the area and you you will be able to edit the content and just in case if you want to use change this vector image so i will tell you where you can get this uh, vector image there is a website called flat icons i am just going to open this is a website where you can get the free vector icons for changing like this like just in case if you want to change this uh, icon uh, of computer so you can find the icon of let us say uh, we are looking for a uh, key let us say key we can find here and also a very simple thing but it is very important so this is these are some images that we can get free it is flat icon.com so just make a note uh, for future references you can use this website this website provides absolutely free vector icons and vector images you can say so just in case if we are matching the content and this is this a key like uh, cell look like this so we can select any key and let us assume we are going to select this so you have all the options so you can download the icons in any size in sbg format or so sbg is in premium version available in premium version but you can ever like uh, it is around 32 pixels so you can download the 32 pixel image so free download is here and you can use the attribution required this is free download and okay so paske pnc has been downloaded in 32 pixel and it can be so 64 pixels should be downloaded so i'm going to use 64 pixels so it is like so okay so i'm just showing you how you can change the icon just delete this icon or upload icon library upload svg you can upload here but svg images are not available here uh, for free and okay so it is premium so if just in case uh, you want to convert the png to svg I mean, you can use any online tool but yes uh, you can use png as well but png is a bit uh, heavy and you can change the image and add the image and so you can use the existing icon library uh, just in case if you uh, you are comfortable with these images and you can use this images just in case uh, if it suits your requirement so you can use or you can upload the image as well okay so it is asking for a pro version okay i'm so sorry so this is not a pro version in this video we are using only the 
free versions icon library can be good and we can also find here so p just in case k is here and it is pretty good so our ob objective to change the icon so k is now here so it is simple to edit the content and mm, in the pro version even you can change the uh, upload the image from external library anyway not a problem so here the text editor and everything can be edited here and just in case if you want to change this background image again i can show you this is the background image so where you can change so it is all cool all fine and i'll show you the customizer as well so this is the footer area where you can edit the footers and all so and now i'm taking you to the background again where you can edit the areas and this can be the certain areas can be like logo and all such things can be edited in the custom edited in the customizer so site identity is here and you have to upload the logo to change this logo so web i am and select an image from your pc and you will be able to change the logo here so just in case if you have selected any particular logo upload file and you will be able to change the logos similarly you have to upload the retina logo and you can uh, use the tagline as well so if you are enabling the tagline it will show the tagline as well so like this so tagline so tagline of the top, top panel so and you can also disable this tagline okay so it is very simple to use i'm just showing the options what you can do exactly so okay you can change the taglines and again now inner side setting web icon you can change from here and breadcrumbs so enable breadcrumbs or if you want to enable or disable it social links you can append and social links in the header if you just in case if you want to show the social links of your social to set social menu so you can set social menu by creating a new menu uh, again you can show, show the social links in the footer as well so it is very important thing page layout you can decide so side width and full width go to top button that shows here so you can use this enable or disable and again i'm going to show you another options so colors you can change the body background color and color scheme yes so this is very important if you want to change the accent color link color invert text color and h2 color so all colors are in your control and this is a free version theme so i must tell you this is free version theme and all control is with you again you can change the typography like body text and header and logo text even you can change the you can use the font family that you need and menu you can change this is for changing the text and even buttons is button controls and the text of button font of button is in your control okay so again header is here okay so uh, you can also enable a top panel so uh, this is you can enable a top panel here and you can use a top panel banner image and you can show a banner and the in the in this area so where my mouse is moving so this is the top panel again okay. so and you might be wondering what about this so welcome to web beyond so i did not found this option where to change this i'll show you uh, ultimately we have to remove this and we also need to remove the foot attached this is um, yeah. this we definitely want to remove and i'll tell you so in the header area this removal is not possible so what i'll i'll show you how you can do this exactly and okay so now on the top panel it has been done and these are the option top panel banner image you can upload an image so you can uh, explore these things and similarly background image can be menus you can decide i'm just giving you an overview 
and the footer again so okay so in the footer area you can change the text from here so this is the text where this is the uh, area where you can change the footer text as, as you seen so this is the text so we can change from the footer area okay so block setting is here so similar block settings so categories and also things and home page setting home is already set because we have already imported the additional css of course if you just want so now only one thing is remaining how to edit the this area so uh, let us go on the live website and view pages option is here and let us inspect how so it is going to the developer website that is going referring to template monster where okay so this is referring to this and definitely we don't want to keep this link and i will show you how you can remove this link let us see where it is from where it is coming and i am inspecting now and okay so this is being the header area and wp content assets image okay so this image can be changed in the wp content so this is the path where you can change the image so the and the wp content level and assets images so I'll show you in the background where you can change this image and after that I'll show you where you can change the link both are important because we this is the link and this is going to the template monster and, and this is the image that we want to change so it is not so difficult but yes you may need a developer help just in case if you are doing at your own and you need our support uh, we will be readily available for doing this, this small thing for you and just share the details of your website with us and use the link given in the description i will definitely help you so any team member definitely yes okay so mm -mm, i'm going to show you how you can change the link so let us come back to dashboard again and i'm changing okay and first of all i'll show you on the back end where we can uh, change the image first of all and because that image is not in our installation it is coming from external resource the thing is that okay so that is image is with us and link is from from, from external resource okay so okay so let us go to the dashboard okay let us go to the themes and we have this web on oh, web on web beyond light and we can go to the assets this is the assets and again uh, in the images so this is the image that we want to change here and what you can do just create a similar image a same dimension image and big and small you need to change and you can change uh, the image source directly from here so you can replace that image directly by uploading a new image here but keep in mind you have to use same dimension image and you can download if you need uh, uh, access of your uh, ftp or uh, file manager and just in case if you are not having the access of your hosting and you want to edit this image i have already added a video in this channel how to edit the wordpress files using the um, wordpress uh, dashboard itself so you can use the file manager access the file manager for from your admin dashboard itself so just in case if you need any help i will definitely let you know how you can so just find that uh, video you will be able to do so okay so you have to change this image I mean open open image in new tab this is the image and we need to change this image so you have to create a similar dimension image and you can replace the image here and you can you have to remember one thing you have to 
keep the image name same exactly same exactly same as it has been given otherwise the link will break so i am so i'm going to show you how why this uh, is uh, why i am saying to keep the same name because it is coming from any external area of code okay so now this is the image where you have to upload your image and uh, okay so now i am going to tell you how you can change the link and this is appearance and so theme file editor option is here and our active theme can be edited and you have to click i understand and find the header area okay so i'll show you this is our website and it is going to new link like this and i'm going to change this link okay so this is the header and i have to find the header where it is style it is here where i missed the header the bull and light is here okay so theme header is here i'm so sorry so you have to find that particular link it should be here it is not so complicated but it should be here okay so i got this link so this is the link and as i was saying you have to keep the image name same because it is calling the image name from bz mon mon2 and source is so image name is here so big and small so just keep the image name exactly same as i shown you and you can replace the image in the same in the in the very simple manner and you have to change this link just in case if you don't want to keep any link you can keep it like has and i have make it has and update the file and okay so now i am refreshing this page and now okay so it is now has so it is not no going not going anywhere it is has now so you can see so it is simple and you might be wondering uh, how you can do all these things so uh, i'm clearly uh, saying in any case just in case if you want a free hosting just follow the link uh, and uh, we will definitely give you pre-installed web ion light wordpress theme and the free hosting you just need to take a domain name and i uh, going i am going to add the link where you can get the domain name in a discounted price so everything is for you and you can start your website at your own without any help of external developers because we are with you and we will definitely going to um, help you in creating your website and you you are going to use free theme free hosting uh, for your website to start your website okay so i believe this video remained helpful for you and i am going to come with another more videos that is going to bring wonderful wordpress resources for you so keep watching keep building just don't forget to subscribe this channel and uh, hit the bell button so that you never miss any update from this channel let us meet on uh, another video thanks for watching keep building